<clears throat> oh, great. That was a terrible one. Lords and ladies, welcome back to my street, Diver Data, with your host, Jacob Butter. Now, I know no one's here for these anymore, but yeah, I do apologize for the delay. I was This was when I was doing the intro for, I guess, Triplet Triumph is the name of the series now. So, yeah, that took a while, and Emily did say she wanted us to be there for the full two hours, because, you know, think about that sweet, sweet watch time, which is uh, not what I do nowadays. So, there you are. Anyways, we're here we're to conclude something. We're here to conclude the timeline of my street, even though there's like a kajillion more entries after this point. Obviously, five years later is not going to stop for the next uh, two years. So <laughs> there you go. Uh, we are barely halfway through, but this is the furthest point in the actual my street timeline as of the time of this recording stream VOD thing. Episode 3 of Her Wish, One Last Time, which immediately makes me think of the Ariana Grande song, which I'm, I don't know if that was done at the same time this came out that was made, but, oh well, who knows? We'll find out. Without further, without further ado, sorry, without further distraction, on with the reaction. Snow to jump in. My apologies. It appears that I've been recording for so or streaming for so long recently, both the Butter Bunch stuff and uh, my own stuff, that uh, this thing ran out of charge. So it's back to terrible mic quality for this one. At the very least, I don't intend, I don't intend to do the classic Kovu at the end of this. So you at least get to see the enthusiastic reactions rather than whatever that was. Okay, anyway, I was saying, wow, she must be thinking, what is she doing? That, that's the recast of Lady Irene? Frolicking around in the snow? My goodness. I don't know. Okay, moving on. Um, you should go enjoy it too. I, I couldn't. Go on. I can tell by your voice that you're really timid. Try to let loose and lighten up a bit. I can tell by everything in her to me that she's very timid. Renee, he'll love it. <laughs> then slowly regret it because it gets wet. But ultimately, it's worth it. <laughs> and again, the frostbite. You don't mention the frostbite. <laughs> Woo! Nice jump! <laughs> <laughs> That's the spirit. It sure is. <laughs> Have you ever made a snowman, Renee? Huh? Uh, yeah, I'll just take the dogs out, and then they spent like it's been like most of yesterday trying to get them back in again. Uh, no. <gasps> Do you wanna? Well, let's build a snowman. <clears throat> <laughs> oh, so close. And the worst thing is, she wouldn't even have got that reference, so she wouldn't have chased you around the house like Caitlin did. Oh well. Aww, I was about to push into song. We know. How do I do that? Well, first you get snow in a ball. Like this. Then you gotta make sure that And Oh look at that, it's the deco craft. Well actually no, it's not Okay, so they did actually chisel and bit like a snowman this time and didn't just use the deco, which is also in the background of this very shot. 
Okay, I appreciate the effort. Oh, my brain. It's so cute. Can we build another one? It's interesting the daughter of Irene also is my arena as an expression. Interesting. Sure. We can build as many as you want. Aww. Great job, Renee. They're so cute. Cut to half to like building like five of the snowmen. Cute together. Uh, I'm sorry I went overboard, but this is my first time doing this. It's so much fun. Does it snow where you're from? No, it never does. I mean, sometimes, but... It's very rare. You have to go. I was gonna say, I'm sure that we've seen like snow biomes and stuff in Minecraft Diaries. Go to another place for snow, but yeah, like snow biomes. Okay, fine, fair enough. Even then, it's not as much as this. Well, here it snows almost every. Year. Oh no! Uh, uh... That was almost her eye. She almost joined Zane. No. <laughs> Speaking of Zane, of course it's him. Your time for vengeance has come, because it technically was Aphna who threw the snowball at you before. <laughs> Merry Christmas Eve. You! Why did you do that? I saw an opportunity and I took it. If you leave yourself unprotected in the snow and know your best friend who is mischievous is lurking nearby, you should expect... I mean, to... Oh, well, it was almost his, uh, his other eye. My goodness. I was going to say, Zane would know from experience about leaving himself unguarded because that's exactly uh, it's like what happened three years ago during the time of season one. Which I know aired two years before this, but again, at nausea, remember people. No, I was monologuing! <laughs> that's what you get for monologuing. What's going mm -hmm. on? We're about to have some fun. Here, throw this at Zane. It, is it okay? Hey, he opened himself up to a snowball fight. Whoa! Very true. Almost had. You gotta build the fort defenses. Get it. Mm, throw it, Renee. <laughs> hey, Zay, do you have? Again, they all go straight to the person's eye. In this, like every time, they have more shots to people's eyes than the actual flashback Ocasis scene. <gasps> this is gonna be good. Oh, it's on! Mm -hmm. Bring it! <laughs> I reckon Aaron's using his snooter to, like, you know, snoot them out. <laughs> snoot them out. That's a, that's a verb. I'm calling that verb now to snoot. Or not to snoot, that is the question. <laughs> this time! Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love how Zane just, like, threw one at Garo just very slightly. Just, just very casually. <laughs> God doesn't care though. He's got his targets in mind. <laughs> What's this? Oh, I'm getting a few supplies for baking ready for Aaron. I need to run an errand. Uh, no pun intended. Uh. But I have something to do at Lucinda's house real quick. So while I'm gone, I've asked Aaron to get cookies ready for the Christmas gathering tomorrow. He bakes cookies too? <laughs> yep, not just pancakes. <laughs> hey, do you think you can help him? Me? Yeah, that'll give you a chance to get to know him. Also, don't tell Aaron this, but I'm going to Lucinda's house to wrap a few presents for him. Ooh, nice. like a secret. Yep, Aaron's nosy and likes to peek around while I wrap Nosy, <laughs> so so I like to do it somewhere else. Would you mind helping him with the baking though? He's going to be using pure chocolate, and baking with chocolate for him is hard. Plus, I don't want him to do the cookies alone. I mean, of course he doesn't get lonely with you guys, but your sass levels have been off the charts lately, you two. That's true, actually. I'd love to do it! Awesome. Sass levels over uh, 9,000. Remember, if you want to veg out in your room, you can. No, I'm fine. This is the first time I've had fun in a family like this. All right, then. Here's the recipes for everything. She's going to stop saying it's her first time doing stuff. She's going to fry suspicion from people, you know. Oh, and my list. I checked it twice, so we won't forget anything again. Hmm. Heading to Lucinda's? Yep. She needs my help with stocking stuffers. <laughs> 
Renee said that she'd help you with baking. I'm sorry, socking stuffers? Do you mean stocking stuff? What? Okay, whatever. Baking. I'll be back in an hour. Mwah. See ya. <laughs> Gotta love that. That is a cute How detail, long have though. you been cooking? I've been towing up for kissing on the cheek. Uh, since I was young. My parents weren't always around, so I learned how to cook my favorite things on my own. Why weren't your parents around? They, uh... Did they die when you were young? No, no, but they... No, big old business. ...were always working. They weren't always around when I needed help. Were you mad... Yeah, they only died recently, actually, <laughs> in the timeline. Hmm. Mad at them for that? Sometimes. But... All There's the a difference between All parents that are gone, and parents that are too busy. How? The ones that are... gone. They probably wanted to spend all the time in the world with you. It's when we have everything that we sometimes take things for granted. We don't realize what's in front of us until it's gone. It's interesting he's saying that now, because again, depending on what we've actually... What actually they think about um, how much was planned for Season 6, it might have already been decided that Derek and Rachel don't make it. So, this could have a double meaning here. And of course, a triple meaning again, because Renee takes it differently. Again, I love the writing of this, because Renee can interpret one thing that applies to her. You get the inner meaning of the future of the season, but you also get the meaning like right in the moment. That's three layers, and that's why I leave I drank two last time. I'm going to wait off this time, but just know it's tempting. I guess in that way, you were very lucky. Hmm? To know what we could have had. It's nice. And that's the double meaning for, for, uh, for Renee, because, you know, Alina, she knows what she could have had. Or who knows, maybe, maybe what she still will have. I mean, crying out loud, there could be an Alina that's born in this time like someday down the line. Everyone's lucky in their own way. Sometimes fate has its own plans. If it counts, I'm glad fate allowed us to meet. <laughs> and so is she. More than, did you only have no idea. <laughs> Ever had raw cookie dough? No. Here, how about you put the chocolate chips in and then you could try it. Uh, it's amazing. Awesome. Love it. Not good in high doses, but you know, still, still great. It's good. <laughs> Did she try her first raw cookie dough? <laughs> I'm just so used to Renee trying her first of everything. She stopped questioning how terrible Renee's childhood was. Yep. Aw, oh, man, I missed it. Don't worry. <laughs> I, want to, I want to film it. Here, eat the cookie dough. <laughs> Come to mama. <laughs> Saved a non-chocolate chip batch for you. Did you finish helping with Lucinda? Yep. She's all ready for Garth's Christmas gathering tomorrow. Now we just gotta finish the oh, dessert God, here, and we're all set for Christmas tomorrow! T oh, he has it before. Tomorrow? Yep. Aren't you excited? <laughs> yeah. How many cookies did you guys make? Just finishing the first batch. Then we got a long way to go. You down, Renee? Absolutely. Oh yeah, Holy Nights. Probably one of my favorite uh, Christmas carols, honestly. Okay, sorry, I'm getting too excited. I need to pay attention to this. Gotta appreciate these no dialogue visual moments when you actually get them. Because you wonder what she's doing. She seems to have already implied that she has to go soon with all the borrow stuff and everything. And here we go. We're halfway through the video, by the way, actually. I'm surprised it's happening so soon. 
Well, I've got a question. Has has uh has Santa like remained in this form the entire time? Like the, that Renee has been here, just never changing back. What the? What the? <laughs> Can I stay for a little longer? I mean, it is Christmas. It's kind of a time to like, go just before Christmas happens. We do not have a lot of time. People need me tonight. I guess that does make sense, yeah. How was your time there? My mom. I had forgotten her face. <laughs> I'm surprised how much she looks like me. Or rather, I look like her. She's as caring as I can remember. And from what others told me, in this world, she's more laid back. I mean, you've seen her be, com uh, be utterly laid back in this one. <laughs> There's like no comparison. I'm happy about that. She has so many people that care for her. That is true. And my That's the beauty of my streets. I mean, this honestly, this whole thing is like a celebration of, of my street in general. I mean, if you if you think about it, you know, Afmo has managed to managed to garner up people who care about her. Sometimes, even to the extent of moving into the same neighborhood as her, and she's kept in contact with all these with all these people. She the, she helps them out when they when they need they need her, and then they help her out too. They just all make each other much happier, and that's a great thing, you know. And, it, and, and, and we as the audience, we always we've 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 grown, but well, some people have grown up alongside these characters. And got and you know they made made us happy too. So yeah, it is great. I mean, people still. I guess. I mean, I've said Mighty my favorite show several times, and of course I've I rip into it more than anyone else now, and it's not without its faults because obviously I wouldn't be here if it if it if it were. But. But yeah, mo moments like these, thinking this this all came from the creation of somebody else two years ago, one person just doing what she wanted you know indulging indulging in whatever with a wackiness she came up with and just in and just letting people enjoy the ride along with her up to the point where we get this emotional moment here that's you know that's been built up for years in two different shows you know because diaries would count as well in that regard so yes this is where my levi drink comes in to my street as a whole, my favorite show. All right, let's go. Dad, no one back home knew him as well as my mom did, but he is much more talkative here. He's determined, kind, and understanding. Maybe because he, of Athmau, He seems rough around the edges, like they said, but... He's so nice. I wonder if, if he was that way with my mom. Well, did I deliver your most wanted wish? Uh, Her yes. wish? Hmm? I just wanted to see them. To see them happy. Even in another. Hmm. Life. Not timeline. If yeah. they're here, does it mean that someday... I'll be here too? I do not know, my lord. Those things are far beyond my knowledge. Of course you can't say for certain because, you know, mystery of the of the future and everything. Who knows? Maybe there'll be somebody sometime down the line that might actually explore that. Instead, as a, as a fan thing. But I do not know. Oh... That does not mean no. Oh yeah, I forgot. He said my lord, so we do confirm that it was Lord Duty she was going to say before, not laundry in the last episode. <laughs> so it does become Lord instead. Okay. Are you ready to go? But also, Irene... Also, um, Michael said that Irene sacrificed her own daughter at one point. Which I guess seems to imply that, you know, again, once again, Lilith has been shafted this reality. Go.
If you need to finish anything here, now is the time. Do it. Get the present. Then they must have been really concerned, Afro and Aaron, to find out that she'd gone so suddenly. And also sign from Melina, which of course signifies to us who she is, but to them, who is this Alina person? And where did Renee go? What just happened? Don't forget sure so me. Yeah. It's going to be like Back to the Future. It's like, Alina, that's a nice name. Anyway, let Holy Knight carry on. Oh, the name's gone. Oh. Is that, is that implying that that, well, that her, she got erased from here at all? I don't know. Also, I've heard these other door opening as well. It's hard to film the light levels and such. Now here comes the real Sylvana. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Oh, I'm so excited! How was your trip, Mom? Wonderful! Eric's sons are always a joy. How about you guys? How Same was Christmas never seen Eve? Apart from Casey. It was wonderful. We made snowmen, baked cookies, and... Oh! Those strawberry puffs for today, too. Uh, that was mostly Aaron, but Renee and I helped. Oh, shoot. We gotta go wake her up. <gasps> That's right! Oh, did someone stay overnight at your house? Y yeah. And this comes across as typical Savannah gaslighting, but for once she's blameless in the event. Renee. Who? Renee? My cousin? The girl you brought over a few days ago? Say what? Young girl, soft voice. Pink dress. You left her here asking us to take care of her. Uh, was it Christmas how much wine? eggnog have you guys had? Huh? Not enough okay, after this. Hey, I don't know if this is a joke or not, but I never, ever brought a girl here. After I left the recipe for you guys, Eric and I headed off. Oh, that's right. Real Savannah, as he did also. You know, I guess Afman would just tell this up to holiday magic, that's also true. But imagine getting this this shock on actual Christmas and, you know, what that would do. Mom, are you sure you didn't? I didn't! I honestly think you two are crazy! What? I was okay, the people, but, uh, I need to go and make up. Christmas breakfast now. You two get some coffee or something to wake up, okay? You both are coming over today, right? Yeah, we are. Wasn't it Garth special? See you guys later. Oh, right. I found this on your porch. It's from someone named Alina. The first nowhere. There we go again. Yep. The angels did say was to certain poor shepherds in This sounds like um a cover by like Lucy or someone. Where they lay. Nice gift exchange though. Keeping their sheep. Garth has a cold of a duck and a Okay. They gave him toys, fair enough. Okay, so Kim's back. Where's Lawrence? Lawrence lives in this house, doesn't he? Is he off 
with his family, maybe. I don't know, I guess. But come on. How hard was it to put him, like, in just um, this Minecraft character in a scene? That's all we needed. There we go. Thank you. There he is. Symbolic leave my drink to Lawrence. My goodness. It's been too long. Ah. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna have to pay. I don't think. Oh wait, yeah. Last in the timeline, she wouldn't use that hat ever. Never mind. He's not even showing his face. Really? He got him the the book that he wrote years ago that has been proven not to work. Are you kidding me? Oh wait, no, no. Sorry, never mind. Volume two by Smooth Dante. Is that what he signs himself as? I should have put that in like my my Dante song in the credits. Smooth Dante. Okay then. All right. He looked up and saw a star shining in the east beyond them far. Alina? <laughs> Sounds like a name that you'd use. Hmm. Marty, what a nice name. <laughs> yep, AAA, because in real life they're all J's. Classic. What is it? They're stockings. Oh, yeah, we haven't seen the ring properly in the shots. The but hey, that's still happening. Born is the king. Born is the king of oh, yeah, the of course. Yeah, I forgot about that. One more snowman. And thus concludes, in the timeline, the series of My Street. And my, what an ending that was. Honestly, I keep, I, 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 you know, going back to Her Wish now, I don't remember, like, a lot of the details of it, because it is, it's one of those things where it's such a simple plot, essentially, that some, like, the details blend in. It's not like with, I guess some of the episodes where there's like the more wacky concepts that happen but then but yeah at the same time it is hearkening back to some aspect of the wackiness of the old my street but you know what it's not just the wackiness her wish goes back to the happiness of my street so honestly it does work as a series finale of sorts obviously it's meant to be self-contained that if you were to watch this, watch my stream in chronological order, which I mean, I personally didn't suggest doing that back when I made my list or anything, but you know, if you're someone like BB, for example, then if you were to do that, I'm pretty sure you'd get a satisfactory experience nonetheless. So, yeah, pretty happy with that. I say that I say it like I'm like I'm proud of the achievement of making us like I didn't. They do this. I'm just saying I'm happy with, you know, how that turned out regardless. Yeah, I don't know. Sorry, I'm, sli I'm slightly uh, going now. My microphone gave out a while ago, and now I also am. <laughs> so, uh, so yeah. <clears throat> what, to, what to say, really? I mean, I, I enjoyed everything about this episode. Could it possibly be one of, my, one of my favorite finales? I reckon. I've got to do a video ranking the finales now, actually, as well. Maybe I should. Maybe I should, yeah. Yeah. And the beginnings. I'll do that. Hmm. But yeah, the, 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 just, I, I just love the... Uh, I basically got to hear like the hearty laugh of, of Rene during the snow, and then, I guess... Santa magic the snow back into it, then back into existence. Obviously, the concern now, of course, is you know where on earth did this Rene girl go? 
why has he happened? Why does I not remember? They're going to have to figure all all of that out, hopefully. I ca- again, you could say holiday magic, but would you? And are you going to? That's the true question. I don't know, honestly. Not pretty for me to say. I love seeing everyone back in the actual neighborhood, even go back to the montage of the actual Christmas times when we actually, you know, saw people in those things. But also in the finales, Christmas and finales, we've had other times where we got the My Street characters just, you know, exchanging gifts and stuff or chattering in the backgrounds. And it is it is wonderful to see everyone, even if they didn't have much of a role to play in this mini series. They played a hard role in the whole series and they impacted us all. So yeah, just 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 wonderful. You know, I've got I've got nothing else to really say. So I'm gonna call it a day. And yes, I know I'm very tired, so I don't do all the rhymes that were required. In fact, I just remembered right now after finishing this video by Afmau. So <laughs> I apologize for that delay. I will do more rhymes some other day. I'm sure the season shall continue and I'll find another another time or venue in which I will be able to well to let the rhymes loose and express my infection with the Seuss. But of course, there, there's, there's now we actually get to the end of this video where it's just where we just wait until the 13th. So that's that's when that's when the next one's going to be. The thirteenth is ending. Same time, same place. Five years later, we're going back to Falcon Claw University. But it's going to be a while, and I have plenty of reviews to do in the meantime. So you know what? That's uh, that's all. That's all good. So yeah, we'll uh, we'll see how that goes. And on that note, until next time, farewell. I feel like I should be a bigger goodbye than that. Oh well. Oh, I didn't mean to, mean to rhyme at that time. Jeez. Okay. <laughs> All right. I'm stopping now. Bye, everyone. Merry Christmas.